guys happy thursday and welcome back to another daily vlog good morning good morning so we are up it's pretty early it's about eight o'clock and i do have a meeting in 45 minutes we have our team meeting so i did get dressed i just have on this like cream colored or tan colored t-shirt and I have on these black slacks that I just decided to put on so I could be dressed for the day. I am going to be going out sometime for lunch. I'm thinking I want to go to lunch, but I want to go somewhere different. I think I'm going to do soup and salad at uh, Olive Garden. You know, they have a really good lunch deal on soup and salads. I'm going to look it up. I think they still have it. That's the only place I can think of that I want to eat that I haven't been in a while. So yeah, I think we're going to do soup and salad. But I also wanted to go ahead before my team meeting, go ahead and make up my bed. I did buy some new sheets, you guys. So I told you I wanted to switch up the color of my sheets for the fall. So I went ahead and got like these beige color sheets from um, Home Goods, from Marshalls. Yes, that's what Charles, in Marshalls when I got those two chairs. Um... And I'll give you guys a little update after we make up the bed because I did get a table and a little lamp to go um, between the two chairs. It looks so good, you guys. I'm so excited. But the lamp, I don't like the light bulb. I got like daylight bulbs in my room. And so when I try to sit in here with the light bulb, the light bulb is way too bright. Y'all know I do not like like dim light or anything that's like that. But I think the ambiance of when I want that lamp to be on is for dim lighting. Just to sit there and you know kind of be laid back. So I'm going to go and find me a light bulb. And I need to find a shorter one too because the light bulb is pretty tall. And it kind of goes over the top of the, um, the shade that came with it. So I'll show you guys that in a minute. But this is what... The sheets look like if y'all can see the color it's like a nice beigey tan color um a little bit darker than my shirt but i'm gonna go ahead and make them take off the sheet that's on there get ready to put them in the dirty clothes so we can wash them later on um this weekend up oh, sorry y'all it's like i took every shoe out of my closet and didn't put it back so i am tidying up my room a little bit as well today it's not bad but my nightstand is a horrendous because i just pile everything over there and clean up at the end of the week don't ask me why um so yeah so that's what we're gonna do so we're gonna make up the bed and um get our lives together for today so let's go ahead and do that i'm gonna put my watch on in a minute i won't put it on now but i'll put it on in a minute and the probably next time you guys will see me will be after my 8 45 meeting um because then we got to do some work. I'll just check in with you guys. And then the next time y'all see me, we'll be at lunch. So let's go ahead and get all of that done. Let's make up our bed and get it all together. And then we will, uh, probably by the time we do that, I can show you a little tour of the, uh, the, the setup here in the front. Even though you'll be able to see a little bit, I can give you a lot more details um, when I'm finished making up the bed. So you can see it a little bit right there, the little... Thing, but I'll go into detail so let's get to make it up this bed.
guys, sorry, I had to go to my meeting first, so I didn't come before it. So the meeting's over, and it's probably about 9.30 now, sorry. Um, we have another meeting in about 30 minutes, so, but this is what everything looks like set up. So like I said, I got these two chairs from Marshall's. They were $150 a piece, so $300 together. I moved the pillows off of my bed to right here. I still wish I could have found something orange to bring in a little bit more orange to the bed, but it doesn't match. That's one thing about finding um, stuff from another store or trying to get something to match is really hard. So I don't know what I want to do. I know it doesn't have to be matchy-matchy, but the ones I got just didn't match nowhere near it. So I want to at least be in the vicinity. So I don't know what I'm going to do about that. If y'all have any ideas, help me. Um, I could get something that's tri-colored, like a bunch of different colors or something, but I don't know if I like that or not, but any hoozy. Back to the chairs, I digress. So these chairs are really nice, like I said. So here's the table that I picked up from Marshall's. It was $39.99. I did get the smallest one. They had a taller one that was $49. They had an even taller one that was $50, but this was perfect which I figured it was. I was hoping it was tall enough and it was, so that's great. And then here's the little lamp that I got. It just has like a little cream base and it was $12.99. It has like this white shade on it. I don't know if I can find another shade. I feel like the white is throwing stuff off, but I don't know. <clears throat> it could be okay. And then you see what I see about the light bulb kind of sticking up above it. I need a, like a shorter one or a smaller one that's um, a warm tone versus a daylight bulb so that it can give me the ambiance that I want. So this is how the chairs look in the bedroom. I'm really loving it. So yeah, tell me what you guys think. I think it goes good. I think it looks better than I thought it would. And I do like the texture on the chairs and I like the color. I think it flows with everything that's in here. So yeah, that's what it looks like you guys. All right, guys, it is almost one o'clock. I have just been working like a crazy person and trying to get some stuff. I'm off tomorrow. I don't want to worry about nothing, but whatever I don't get done, I'll just be like, we'll look at it on Monday. Um, so I'm about to get ready to go. Like I said, I usually try to go lunch at 12, but it's almost one o'clock now, so it is what it is. Um, I'm going to run by the water company and uh pay my water bill because i ain't paid in two months they told me they gonna cut it off child it's only 56 dollars that ain't even acting like i owe them 100 million dollars jesus <laughs> i think i'm gonna just suck it up no i'm not because i think they they still too expensive for me to pay i just can't pay that much money like it was a couple cents fine i think it's just the principle of the thing maybe one day i will stop and pay them online but i just can't do it right now it's just i think they're charging way too much so i don't want to fork over the money unfortunately um so we got my keys my wallet my phone my ear pods y'all i cannot find my tripod to my camera i remember having it saturday i don't know where it is now i looked everywhere for it and i can't find it so i don't know where it is somewhere in this house oh then i can think of but i don't know where but i will see you guys in the car um and when we headed out to run some errands and get us some lunch um at olive Garden. so let's go all right you guys it's 12 53 and we're leaving the house finally i don't know where my tripod is and that tripod was expensive Shit. i need to be trying to find that I literally cleaned up my room. Put it everywhere for it. I don't know where it is. <sighs> I swear. That's why I need to get my office together so I can start putting stuff back where it goes. I don't want to learn about losing and be all over the house. Who knows where it is? Y'all, it's only 85, but I'm sweating so bad. Lately, I've been sweating like a crazy person. Y'all, the leaves are falling. It's crazy. Like, <clears throat> it's like as soon as September hit, all the leaves started falling off the trees by my house. Like, they're turning golden and they're brown and reddish. So pretty. 
I am loving it. Oh, this one right here in this front of this lady. I can't show you this because it's near my house. But the whole tree has turned colors. It's absolutely stunning. I'm so excited for fall, y'all. I'm so ready. As you can tell. So, so ready. But I'm ready for the cool weather. But it's 85, y'all. It's 1 o'clock. So that's great, right? But I'm sure, I'm sh pretty sure we're going to have a heat. Uh, a heat flash or a heat uh, period before fall truly comes in. But I can't wait until the last remnants of summer are over and we're fully into the cozy season. Yay! I'm so excited. Bop, bop, bop. I just can't hide it. Bop, bop, bop. Uh, 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 and I think I like it. <laughs> Don't mind me. Uh, I'm just a weirdo sometimes. But let's go pay this water bill so people can leave me alone. And then let's go get us some lunch. And then I'm paying the water bill $100. I always pay over my water bills. I can have a credit. So I like to do that. Because I don't like being bothered with them like that. So we're going to pay them $100. And that means next month I should have a credit. And then the next month I should have. Next month I shouldn't have to pay anything. And then the month after that I should have to pay a little bit. And what I usually do is start paying back regular until I have a credit. What happens is when I don't pay, I get a late charge that needs up my credit. And so... just get going because I don't know what time lunch is over. I didn't look it up y'all and I probably should have but I didn't. Hopefully it's like not over to like 2 or 3 or something. I'm sure it's not over at 1 o'clock. It's not going to take me any longer than like 15, 20 minutes to get down there so we should be good. Enough to get about two bowls of soup because I can't eat unlimited nothing anyway. I get two bowls and then I get a bowl to go and then I get some bread sticks to take home and then that'll be my dinner. Like that's usually how I do it. So that's what we're going to do tonight as well I forgot that I forgot today is Thursday I keep forgetting today's Thursday I'm just so behind today but let's pay our bill and be on our merry way you guys so. usually don't be no cars when I come up in here but they got some cars in here today and they got a handicap. Those are handicap spots. I ain't even never recognized them. Those are handicap spots. Let me park in between these two people right here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. See y'all in Olive Garden. Protecting my peace for so long. A little too good now. I'm so low. Watching reruns of the same shows. Almost everybody on my no show. Even with green lights, I don't go Never been sure, no, I don't know How does everybody has to let go of the ego? Don't go out nearly as much as I should Barely know the way around my neighborhood I'm ruminating, I feel no good Not living life like I know I could Like I know I could Like I know
guys were out. Everything was so good. I never can. <laughs> Let me tell you something. I can never do all you can eat. I literally had one bowl of soup and then I took the other bowl with me. And I had like two breadsticks, some drinks, and um, some salad. Now let me tell you something. Always be nice to your waitress. Like be nice, be respectful. You know, there's no reason to be rude. Cause I had a really good waitress, but the people like behind me was so rude to her. Like they was trash. I don't know what the fuck their problem was. But she was really nice to me. Like I was like, yeah, can I have some, some go boxes? And then I was like, can I have another one? Cause I wanted to take the leftover salad with me. Cause I told you, like I said, when I have leftovers, I just eat it for dinner. Um, and she was so nice. She was like, no, I bring you like a to go salad. So she brought me, you know, like when you take stuff to go at the restaurant, they have the big salad with the crudo. She brought me a to go salad, y'all. And she was, I know she wasn't supposed to because it first of all it was all you eat super salad. You're supposed to take whatever's left over. And she was nice enough. And I mean, she really anticipated everything that I would ask her for. So I didn't ask her for it to go drink at all. She just brought me one. And then after that, she saw I was eating really slow and she probably kind of saw that I was full and she just bought me a container for my soup and then when I asked for another one she's like oh you want to take salad to go too and I was like yeah and she's like okay I bring you a salad like just be nice people just be nice you know I, that's weird coming from me because sometimes I can be mean but I don't be mean to people who not mean to me first if that makes sense so I just try to be nice to folks and uh you know treat people like I want to be treated now if you act a fool I'm act a fool I'm just gonna tell you now <laughs> but other than that <laughs> be nice people I'm still working on it. <clears throat> being nice even when they ain't nice I ain't really got that concept yet but any hoozy so I of course over here by TJ Maxx Target I ain't going in Target though like Target like Target be having me messed up when I go in there I might run in there and then they have a Burlington over here I forgot they put a Burlington over here so I think I'm gonna run into TJ Maxx and Burlington and I wanted to run into books. I can't remember. Did they close the books a million of down over here? Or is it still open? I can't remember. I'm going to park like halfway between um, TJ Maxx and Burlington. That way it's the same walk from one end to the other. So I don't be feeling like I had walks a real, real far. <laughs> so I'm going to park right here. And then we're going to go in here and see what we can see. I forgot about outside on the deck. I feel like I need like some fall color blankets because the other ones are more like spring and summer and so I was going to put them up with the rest of my spring and summer stuff and have like two matching blankets out there for fall colors I feel like I'm turning into this person who's getting all of these things and becoming this person who likes to decorate and I don't know if it's more because Jalen isn't here and I just want to have things to do because she takes all my time she really just entertains me I miss my little bookie bookie She's such a cootie patootie. Even though she get on my damn nerves sometimes. I still love her to death. So yeah, we just be trying to waste time and act like we got a fucking life without her. <laughs> I'm so sad, ain't I? Anyway, let's go in here and hope we don't spend a lot of money, but we're going to spend some money though. So let's go. Alright, you guys. I found this throw. I wish I could have found two. I only found one, but I love it. It's so nice. I probably could put this like in one of my little chairs in my room. Bring a little color. Very nice. And then I found two matching ones for out there on the deck. I think these would be really nice out there. And then I found two fall pillows that I could switch out those pillows with. They look like this. They match, they're super cute. And then I found this nice little set that I wanna try on, see how it looks. And uh, yeah, we probably ain't gonna go into Burlington because I wouldn't try and spend this much money. But I wanted to decorate the deck today and clean it up. Or maybe I'll do it tomorrow in the weekend vlog. You guys will see how everything comes together. One of the two. Um, but yeah, we're still going to continue to look around. They're getting a lot of the stuff. They got a great set of those chairs. By, these are by Nautica as well, as you can see. But they're not textured, but they're great. These are really nice. I wanted these are 150 as well. They are, yeah, 149 how much I paid for mine. And then I was looking at those, but I didn't like the back being open like that. And they are, let's see how much they are. They're only 129 and they swivel as well. So they're getting a lot of little stuff out here for fall. They got stools and all kinds of stuff, like just regular chairs, a couple of furniture pieces. They got a lot of baskets. So if you like 
Y'all know I use baskets and storage in my home because I don't have a lot of storage. So I am really love a good basket to put things in. So yeah, oh, they got some more blankets over here. I wish if they would have had two matching one of these, I would put them out on the deck, but they don't. I can't find another matching one. I kind of like this one too. This is a 50 by 70. These are 50 by 70. Let's see. I feel like this one has more of like the gray and all the colors for the deck on there. Um, let's see how much these are. These are 24 and the ones I got are 16. So we're gonna stick a 16. Yep, that part. Uh, <laughs> that part. Um, but they have some nice blankets. These Chanel blankets are so soft, you guys. That's why I got them, because they're so soft and good to cuddle up with. But they got a lot of Halloween pajamas out and everything. They're getting everything out. All the little woodland creatures <laughs> are out here and about. But yeah, they got a lot of stuff, you guys. Alright, you guys, can y'all see me? Is this going to lighten up? Uh, I think it will lighten up. I'll move you guys a little bit. I think that's as light as we're going to get. So, as you guys can see, I did find a 40 watt. The bulb still sticks over. I think it's just really small. Now, you can push this up like this. So, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to find something to keep it up because it sits on this little ledge that sits kind of low. But if I can find some stuff to stack to make it sit up higher I think I would feel better but I do love the little lamp um so that's that but I also thought about getting a candle warmer instead as a little lamp so I have a dual purpose versus this one this is why I haven't taken the tag off of it but I haven't decided that yet y'all let me know what y'all think because I feel like a candle warmer would do good but I also have a diffuser in here so I don't necessarily need a candle warmer so I'm debating on that so let's go ahead and get a haul this might be my last fall haul I believe so this is a haul for the deck I didn't think I would decorate the the deck for fall but I'm actually having a um, birthday dinner in October at my house and so I want it to be like festive because I am because it is fall fall is like my backdrop for the event and so it's gonna be a lot of like oranges and stuff and just fall inspired so I thought I would get some stuff to go with it so I got these beautiful pillows do y'all see this so it's like a heather gray color but then it has two orange color pumpkins and then a cream pumpkin these were $20 a piece It's made out of really good fabric y'all really soft very um squishy what I like about it is I can recover this because it does unzip I can find some covers if I want to change this out on the deck so I don't have to um, buy new pillows. I'm all about stuff that um, can be repurposed where I can take off the pillow cover because once again storage is an issue for me. Um, so I try to think of ways where I can have what I want but also be able to repurpose it for another season. So I could go on Amazon and I can get a Christmas cover for this these two pillows and I can still use them on the deck by taking these off and saving them for next fall. As had to have it and it goes in with my my theme of my home like I said I try to get everything to be like where it can flow and it can be used in any place at home like say I don't want to use these on the deck next year. I literally can put one of these on my bed and it'll look really good in here as well. I could put one in the den. I could put one, you know, in my office, wherever. I just love it, y'all. So I tried so hard to find two of these blankets, but they only have one. I will tell you this. If I go to another TJ Maxx and I see another one, I'm getting it. Just just know it. If you see this at a TJ Maxx, hit your girl up on the social media. It's $24.99. Ship it to me. I will cash app you back, okay? I love the pumpkin. I love how simple it is. I love that it has a little green, a little cream, and it has the orange. And most of all, I love the feel of it. It's a Chanel throw um, and it's reversible. So you see how it's cream here. If you want to reverse it and you like a little, a lot more green, you can reverse it and everything is backwards. So now the cream, the green 
leaves are cream and then all the cream that was here is green and of course the pumpkins and the flowers are the same exact color y'all this is the most beautiful blanket so i'm gonna sit this in one of these chairs here i want it too because i wanted one for each chair is that bad do i need one for each chair i don't know but did i want one for each chair i did don't say that <laughs> so i absolutely love this i bought this for my room um like i said it is reverse it was absolutely stunning i think i'm gonna get out of the house this weekend and like just do some perusing i don't know if i'm gonna actually shop but i feel like i want to go to some antique shops i feel like i want to go to some thrift stores i want to go to the outlet so we might do a little outing this weekend i might call my friend ophelia because she loves to go out child and shop around so she might be down for it but um these are the two blankets that i got for the deck so these are also 50 by 70 oversized so we can cozy up and they have a little bit of fringe at the bottom um it's not super super fringe but just a little bit and it's these were 16 dollars, so they weren't that expensive actually the pillows cost more than so you see how this will go really beautifully together and then out on the deck with the wood and all of that it'll match really really well so i got two of those and then that's all i got you guys well actually i got um two more things but they're not fall decor so i got two of those because i don't know out on the deck i'd be a matchy matchy person if one if one seat got one cover i want the other one to have a cover too but i know you don't have to do that but i'll be doing it anyway so i got these orchard valley harvest um nut packets you know these things are expensive y'all so I got them on clearance for $7. So this one's a 15 pack. It's the Omega 3 mix. It has walnuts, dried, sweetened cranberries, almonds, and pistachios. And it doesn't expire until April 2025. So I always look at your expiration date. They look like this. These things are so good, you guys. Let me see if I can peel this off and see how much they regularly cost. I feel like these be costing like a million dollars. Like nuts and peanuts and shit like that is expensive. I can tell you that now. It says they was regularly eleven fifty. Is that right? That's a lot of money. I guess you get fifteen of them. I don't care if I can get it on sale. I can get it on clearance. I'm gonna do that. Oh, I'm gonna save some money. And then I got another pack. That's the uh, trail mix. So that's the uh, omega three mix. Um, and I don't know what it's good for, but it just says omega three mix. And then this was the cranberry almond cashew trail mix. So it has dried, sweetened cranberries, almonds, and cashews in it. And this is also a 15 pack. So I basically have 30 of these to snack on. Because I'm trying not to buy candy, y'all. I'm trying not to buy candy. So sweetened almonds. I love craisins and um, stuff like that. So these sweetened cranberries are sort of like craisins. But I do love almonds. I love cashews. I love pistachios. And I'm not a big walnut fan, but I'll eat them. Um, so, yeah. But that's what I got. Two different kinds of little snacks for me to snack on. So, if y'all see me right here eating packs of peanuts, then, you know, that's what had happened. But what I'm about to do is go ahead and I am going to put some deep conditioner in my hair. I need to wash my hair. I haven't washed my hair in probably two weeks. So, it's about that time. Um, where did this lid come from? Where did it come from? But that is all that I picked up at the TJ Maxx. Like I said, I'm going to try to go to another TJ Maxx and see if I can find this blanket somewhere. This is absolutely stunning and so soft. Like, I want to try it right now. Hold on, let me see if we can open this up. I hate it when they put these little things in there. I feel like it will snag the blanket. And, you know, I don't be liking to have no holes in my blanket. Once you get a little hole in it, you know, sometimes it'll keep going. I don't know why they put holes in shit. Like, this just doesn't make it. Put a hole in the damn tag. Why do you put a hole in the actual blanket? Like, to me, that's just so trash. <sighs> but that's just me. Is that it? Lord Jesus. All right. So, y'all can see the blanket. This is one side. And then this is the other side. So you can literally just cozy up. Ooh, it feels so good, y'all. <laughs> anyway, we got a lot to do today. Like I said, I need to put some deep conditioning in my hair. I need to wash the dishes and put them up. I need to clean up my kitchen. Um, 
I might go ahead and organize the deck and clean it up from this weekend and uh, put these decorations out there so y'all can see how they look and maybe we'll sit out there a little bit later. I might even roll my little TV out here so we can watch some TV on the deck this evening. I just feel like being outside but not going anywhere if that makes sense. So I think that's what I'm going to do today. Um, so yeah, I will see you guys when we are finished deconditioning our hair and we're ready to wash the dishes. I really feel like taking a nap, but I ain't going to do it. It's 448. If I take a nap, I ain't waking up no more. Not today. Not until mañana, okay? That part. So let's go ahead and be productive. We did good at work today. So let's go ahead and be productive in our house. Um, and then we have dinner, of course, because we still have the leftover olive garden. So that'll be dinner tonight. But I love this blanket, y'all. It is so nice. Ooh, it's nice and cozy, too. It feels good. If I be on this chair when I come back and my deconditioning ain't in there, y'all have permission to talk about me. <laughs> Just so y'all know. I'll be back. <laughs> stars come to shine when it's dark from so far away show us where we are what makes the sun go to sleep every night and what's it dreaming of i wonder Sky sometimes hides behind the clouds Maybe it's just like me A little bit scared of heights Why does the rain always keep on pouring down When it's gray outside It really makes me wonder As you saw me I just got through cleaning up the deck from Labor Day I know Labor Day was like uh, Sunday when we partied but I'm just not getting to it today yeah on the Thursday so everything is basically put back in order there's a couple of things out here that weren't here before like my wagon I brought this plant out here but other than that I've reset 
everything I got a couple of foldable chairs there but here is the new update so we did put in the new fall decor it looks so good it's not over the top fall it's just letting you know hey fall is coming put a little orange out here get some pumpkins and some other kind of stuff I may find a couple things for the table where I may change out these two little pillows because I forgot about these two but I might get pillow covers for these instead of um, getting uh, new pillows because these do open up as well um, so I might look at the size and get something for those but if not y'all why does this freaking lizard keep coming right here and he just gets in between my screen and just be having him a good old time hiding in between my screen I don't know why he keep doing it I be thinking he dead but he not dead I just flick at him and then he run off I don't know why he keeps going right there I don't know if something's after him and he's hiding or what but he's always right there now um, but yeah but this is what the deck looked like for fall so nothing over the top like I said I'm super simple one or two changes to let you know the season is out there and then we'll be start looking for some Christmas stuff to put out here I'll probably maybe put some lights on that maybe like some string lights for Christmas or I may not it just depends on how difficult it is to have lights on there put them on if I put them on there they're gonna stay there forever like I'm not gonna take them on and off like they'll just be on there uh, and then we'll just get some more blankets matching blankets maybe not matching pillows but same for here so we'll figure out what to do out here during the holiday season as well but I think this can stay out here until fall time is over even Thanksgiving per se but yeah that's outdoors so we're gonna go back inside and I'm about to wind down for the night I have not eaten my leftovers from Olive Garden yet I'm still kind of full it's only eight o'clock I don't have to go to work tomorrow so it doesn't like I don't have to go to bed I'm actually going to do y'all them lights scared me so bad I was like why did that light turn off but I forgot I had them on timers I was like what happened y'all I'd be scared when stuff go out I'll be forgetting so I have timers on my light warmers and they've been running for I think I had them on four hours so it's eight o'clock now so they've been running since like four or something like when I got off work and it smells really good in here so we're just gonna leave them off and we'll turn them back on in the morning my diffuser is going in my bedroom um did i show you guys this is how i put the blanket on this chair i put it on the green side to bring some color but i don't know if i like it on the green side or not but yeah i'm loving the warm light now versus the harsh white light so when you turn out all the lights i think it's going to be looking really really uh give me the ambiance that i'm going for let me turn this light out so you can see so you can see how it looks now it's like the warm light versus that bright white light this is what i was looking for just calm cool and collected and then i could turn on the fireplace you know just a vibe you know what i'm saying so i'm about to get in the shower you guys and then i will check in with you guys in a minute like i said i'm not gonna wash my hair out until tomorrow so i probably just put a bonnet on my head and then we'll get up in the morning we'll probably be up early in the morning because i'm always up early just you know hit the ground running to work on our next project uh for the uh the weekend i have several things that i want to get done this weekend um several things i want to clean up and all that kind of stuff so i will be right back guys so we're all showered i haven't brushed my teeth or washed my face yet because i'm going to go ahead and warm up my food <clears throat> it's pretty late it's almost 10 o'clock but I'm hungry, so we're gonna warm up our soup. Let's see. And I'll probably leave my salad for tomorrow. And then I was drinking a lot of little drinks. So I got the, I think the peach bellini iced tea. Y'all, this had water in it and this shit's still sweet. Like this is good. They put way too much sugar in there, but it's good. Um, so we're just going to warm this up right quick. I'm going to put it on a minute and 30 seconds. And we're going to go ahead and take our peach bellini in here. And I did bring in, like I said, I don't buy new stuff. 
So I did bring in a coaster that I already had to put right here when I have my drink. And uh, we're gonna wind down for the night. Probably watch, catch up on some YouTube. My remote right there. Go ahead and turn this light off in the bathroom. Get the ambiance going. So like I said, this is going to be a whole vibe uh, sitting here and watching TV and stuff. You know, having a good time in my chairs here. a little bit too long so I'll let it cool off some and find something to watch on this here TV Chilly, I thought you turned my fan off, y'all. <clears throat> I'm a little cold. Hi, I'm Ronnie. Okay, hello everybody. Welcome to Korean Atlanta Mentorship, and we're just going to do another velocity banking review. So, um.